What a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga. It's Bochum, and they face Armenia Bielefeld. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, it's regarded as a negative shape. If they control the middle of the park, play some expansive football, the wide players can then come in field to join the centre forward and the full-backs can push on. Let's hope they do that today. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And the match is underway. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Could be troublesome. And crossing towards the far post. Well, when it left the boot, I thought it might have a chance of fooling the keeper, but it didn't. Well, here's something the visitors know they've really got to work on, Stuart. And talking about scoring goals, they just haven't had the magic touch. Well, too many passes go sideways and backwards. And unless they continue to play more forward passes, their struggles in front of goal will continue. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, I'm sure the replay will confirm he got a touch on this, which he does. So he'd be really upset that he didn't keep it out. The match has restarted, 1-0 here. He continues his run. Well, they're doing their best to get on level terms here. Well, it's a decent effort, but they're still trailing. They need something special here. Not a good pass. Joachim Nielsen. Not the best clearance. Can he get them level? And a goal, the equaliser. 
Superb entertainment. Well, here it is again, and the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area, just poor defending all round. So the ball is rolling again at one all. And scope for them to produce something exciting. And dealt with that ball comfortably. Big chance! Well, the only way to say it is he got it all horribly wrong, Stuart. Well, he has to make the keeper work harder than that. That's a tame finish. Well, that's a super ball over the top. Dangerous looking attack. Could take the lead. A stellar piece of defending. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. It's got to be. Well, not hard to read that pass. Serra. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Excellent defending. Jakob Barrett Larsson. Serra. Real chance. What a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Can they forge ahead? Marvellous anticipation. Elvis Rejbetsai. Lucia. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Not a cross that will live long in the memory. Goal kick. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Well timed tackle. Well, flinging himself at it. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Let's see about the delivery. On the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Vasiliadis. Okugawa. Extremely sloppy in possession. Envis Rejbetsai and continues his run but they took care of the situation defensively the referee's letting it go as they keep the ball Serra on the ball with Schupf 
And the emphasis is on creativity. Take it away. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Oh, tight offside decision, but the flag does go up. Well, the referee let it go initially, but now he goes back and cautions him, Stuart. Yeah, it's a good bit of refereeing. He tried to let the play continue, and then he came back for the booking. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Rietl. And teammates to play it to. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. And they need to get tighter here. Promising position, this. It's still alive. Oh, it's gone in, would you believe? And that is going to be classified as an own goal. Well, as you can see, it came off him last. And as a result, it will be an own goal. So unfortunate. Well, that own goal has put them behind. 20 minutes remaining. Nathan de Medina. Okugawa. Can he play it in? Not the best clearance. And it's in! All square again. What a match this is turning out to be. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So back underway, dead level, 2-2. David Holtmann. Well, he's beaten his man comprehensively. No nonsense clearance. What a pass that lacks quality. Good technique displayed. Electing to cross into the centre. It comes to absolutely nothing. Oh, could be. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance, and the fans are lapping this up. Well, here's the replay and confirmation that he did get a touch on the ball. Unfortunately, it wasn't enough to prevent the goal. a big moment in the dying embers will it prove decisive here Amos Pipa 
There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. And close, but offside nonetheless. And time for the change now. Well, shortly we'll hear the final whistle. The home side with the lead. Stuart, what have you made of this? Well, it's been great entertainment and we've seen some excellent attacking football. But overall, I think they've been the better team. They've certainly had the greater cutting edge. Now they just need to see this out in the final few moments. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Robin Hack. And a good-looking ball. And that will be all for this game anyway. And defeat for the visitors, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, that shows the problems facing the coach. They've struggled to score goals. So then he allows them to play with more freedom and they look much better going forward. But as a result, they're left exposed at the back. He just has to find that happy medium. Possession to give them the lead, maybe. And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. He continues his run. Well, they're doing their best to get on level terms here. Well, it's a decent effort, but they're still trailing. They need something special here. Can he get them level? And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, flinging himself at it.